What a glorious day for a car show. Too bad you weren't here two hours ago. The skies opened up from over there, the wind blew in, microburst. We're at the what used to be called the Stowe Car Show in <laughs> Waterbury, Vermont. The uh, Ben and Jerry's factory is probably three miles up the road and Stowe is 30 miles up the road, but we don't go there anymore. I drove the Toronado last minute, had a lot of things to do. I've got some news to tell you also, but we'll first show you the, the car. It's beautiful. Billy Good Tin Body was here, but he's gone in his Corvair. And I just stumbled across this fellow that does 409 parts, 348, 409, the so-called W engine. He's got all kinds of goodies. He's got a 59 or 60 Pontiac hubcap. Got a brand new 409 water pump, 64. I wonder what differs from the 63. Got some water outlets, and we got some really interesting looking exhaust manifolds. Long run, kind of like the Pontiac 376 HO exhaust manifolds. This one's had a little bit of brazing work. These sound really thin. Huh. What did he do? Hit a pothole and pull the whole bottom off? Wow, that thing is beautifully welded, but a little pinhole here. Someone did a good job. And this one's. <laughs> Rusted right through. I wonder how that happened. The high miles 409 with these long branch exhaust manifolds. We've also got some stuff that was under cover that I gently removed the plastic from because it rained here to beat the band. Four two barrel Strombergs on an Offenhauser, two four barrels, a GM Winters foundry, another GM Winters foundry, a 56 57 Corvette with two cargo, probably AFBs and a Spread bore winters casting something or other. What does this fit? This fits 78 Corvette L82. Yeah, EGR. An Offenhauser 2.4s, probably for a 409. They're kind of narrow on the top, narrower than a small block Chevy. If you look at this, let's see. Yeah, pretty close. Considering the 409 was a 348 409 and the small block started off life as a 265, ending up as big as a 400. Same width. Interesting. We've got some wild Edelbrock XG8. Got a few odds and ends of 409 stuff, but the gentleman's not here. Ron Posley, Earlton, New York, wherever the heck that is. He is a 409 man, just like me. I'm headed out to uh, the West Coast to get another 409. One's good, two's better, three's the charm underneath this military tarp. Boxes of 409 parts, crates covered up. We had a microburst, tents were flying, boxes were flying, hats were flying, umbrellas were flying, and the rain was flying. It was raining to beat the band. This oil pan would be a 409 because of dipsticks on the passenger side. Let's see what the yellow tag says. 409, seven quart oil pan. This man has 409 parts. Well, we had a good time, and we're headed back. We've got an early morning flight to catch. We've got a wedding to attend, Mr. Spiked Punk. Got some business to take care of, and we are on our way to catch a flight <laughs> right back here in Vermont, off to Toronto. Oh, life is good, life is short. Drive a big, beautiful car as much as you can. I'll be showing you more videos in the near future, and i got some news to share with you. Not the best, but i got to tell you what's going on.